Oh my god. <laughs> Tatagay mo na ako. Tatagay mo na ako before ko magkwento. <laughs> hey, shop nga. Pasa naman dito. <laughs> Teka lang. Wait. Kalma? <laughs> Parang nag-anxiety attack ata ako eh. Nangangati ako bigla. <laughs> Nagbabalik si Ate Totka kasi <laughs> hindi ko alam nag-viral pa yung comment ko. <laughs> so yun nga, the reason why I'm making this video ay eh, kasi maraming nagtatanong kung ano pa talaga nangyari, yung full story. Apparently, hindi pa full story yung nilagay ko na comment na pagkahaba-haba. Anyways, uh, in this video, I'm gonna be speaking Tagalog since a lot of the people that nag-comment, saka nag-react, yung mga nag-retweet, nag-share sa Facebook, mostly mga Pilipino, so magtatagalog ako. I'll try to do Tagalog as much as possible because I don't speak Tagalog. I'm Bisaya, so I'm not Bisaya. So I'm not going to say it, but I'm not going to say it. So I'm going to say Tagalog. But for anyone who doesn't understand Tagalog, I'll post a description, an English translation on the description below if you want to read a whole lot of words. A whole lot of paragraphs because I'm going to be a long time here. But anyway, I'm going to start. So, andi, andito yung computer ko ah. Pag-cheat-cheat ko to eh, para mas magkakatagalog ako ng maayos kaysa sa English or Bisaya. <laughs> so, unang-una sa lahat, gusto ko mapasalamat sa lahat ng mga tao na nag-message sa akin through Facebook, through Twitter, through uh, YouTube, yung nagko-comment sa akin na ano, mga virtual hugs, then, yeah, virtual hug back <laughs> sa lahat. So thank you, thank you. Uh, I didn't expect na mag-viral. Thank you so much, uh, Maple from Twitter. She has a screenshot ng comment ko from Alexa's cover of the song The One That Got Away by Katy Perry na she uploaded just, I think, a few days ago or a few weeks ago, I think. I really didn't think na magkakalat yun. <laughs> so, I just ko na lahat ng feelings ko doon. I mean, it didn't help na umiinom ko nung tinatype ko yung comment na yun. <laughs> but anyways, Napa share bigla. Yeah, thank you Maple from Twitter sa pagkalat pag viral nung nang comment ko. Medyo nahiya talaga ako at first kasi baka mabasa ng ibang tao na makakilala namin. Kilala lang kilala pa naman kami sa buhol. Whoever knows the story, wag na lang i-comment yung pangalan ng lalaki please kasi ayo I don't want to get in trouble or masaya na siya. <laughs> so, wag wag na natin guluhin. Anyways, Story lang naman yon. It doesn't mean na hindi pa ako nang move on. That's just a story of my Todga. So, kalma lang. Hindi nervous ako. Teka, teka. Dal dal na ako na dal dal. Wala pa ako na narating. Teka lang. Check mo na ako yung script ko nito galog ka. Sige nang I'll start na. Okay. So una una. Best friend talaga kami noon since high school. No first year high school, dun kami nagmeet. Then naging best friends kami for about I would say two three years. And then nalala ko pang ano? May boyfriend ako. Iba pa yung boyfriend ko kasi partly maaga ako na boyfriend. Thirteen years old na boyfriend na. So yung first boyfriend ko, I was with him. Kilala niya, friends din sila, but hindi close. Like I think they just went to the same school no elementary ata. So he knows him, right? Uh, nalala ko yung nag-break kami ng, ng first boyfriend ko. iyak iyak talaga ako. Thir uh, ano ako nun eh, uh, third year high school. Nalala ko siya yung nagko-comfort sa akin, yung si Mr. Totga. Friend, best friends pa kami nun. Nahag niya ako ganyan din. Ako, buhos ng buhos talaga nang iyak kasi nga, first breakup eh. Kaya medyo sensitive si Totga, si ati Totga. Um, but anyways, May, may kumuha na picture nun eh. Kaya lang hindi ko malala. So, whoever has a picture, pakisend naman sa akin. Huwag mo na may public na ipost. <laughs> Maawa po. Huwag naman. I, ano lang, i-PM mo lang sa akin sa Facebook. Kasi I, I just want to see it. Uh, may copy ako noon, but printed. Uh, printed version na. Pero ano na to? Naiwan na to. Spinas. May slambo kasi kami noon eh. Wow. <laughs> Then, tawang tawa pa ako kasi at that time, yung, di ba uso-uso yung movie na Twilight, di ba? So, may Edward, Bella, tsaka Jacob. Nalala ko yung sa friend ko na kumuha ng picture na, na yun, nung kinomfort niya ako. Nikalagay pa niya, nilag, blah, blah, blah. nilagay pa niya, Bella and Jacob kasi nga mag best friend, di ba? I mean, who would have thought na naging Edward pala siya after a few months? So, after a few months noon, naging kami. 
like we started dating kasi yung, yung, yung mga tao sabi pati hindi lang kayo eh may best friend kayo you, you take care of each other you love each other yung parang ganyan so after a while yung parang i guess nagkaka-develop pa Nung lumalabas na kami na kami lang dalawa, I guess nagkaka-start na nagka-developan. And then, naging kami. Finally, di ba? And, um, tawang, tawang tawa ako pag naalala ko kasi balik-balik kami sa sa counselor noon. <laughs> kasi, yung, kasi yung school namin na high school, I, very, ano, very strict, Catholic high school. So, bawal yung may jowa-jowa. Hindi pwede yun. Kahit wala kayong ginagawa sa school, pero mag-jowa kayo. Pag nalalaman, tinatawag kayo sa counselor. So, kami, Kami dalawa, nagiging so kila kami doon. <laughs> kila, alam, kila lang kilala na kami. Alam na alam na ng mga teacher. Kaya pabalik-balik lang yung report doon. Nagiging so kila nga kami. Nagiging markada na namin yung counselor. Kaka, kaka ano namin ng session sa kanya. <laughs> sa nakakatawang kwento pa no, nung, nung, ano, nung junior prom at senior prom. Kasi classmates kami. So, ano nga, e Catholic school, e bawal magpartner partner So, parang ano ba? You'll fall in line, lahat ng babae dito, lahat ng lalaki dito. Um, yung parang kung whoever na, I think, alphabetic pala ito, yun eh. Yung malala. Pero alam naman ako, hindi kami magiging partner kasi yung, yung, yung lasing ko, Silmaro, sa kanya. So, S, tsaka A, layo ah. So, hindi talaga kami magkaka-partner sa, ano, sa prom. Pero, kasi nga, alam ng buong school. Kaya, hinijack namin yung system. <laughs> hinijack. So, hinijack namin yung system. Um, yung para bang kahit ano pag pag palapit na siya na magkaka-partner na siya ng iba at siya then mauuna yung whoever yung sa, sa sa likod niya para hindi sila magka-partner ng 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 job ako at that time so pag yung ako na pag si Lamaro na doon na siya doon na siya umi insert kaya <laughs> yung junior prom tsaka senior prom hinijack talaga namin yung system so i mean so i mean I don't mind admitting this because I'm pretty sure na alam na alam ng mga teacher yung nangyari kasi I mean, coincidence ba naman na kaming dalawa yung mag-partner lang, di ba? So, alam na nila, but they just didn't say anything. So, here comes graduation. Iba-iba na yung life, di ba? Ako, mag-nursing ako sa Tagbilaran, sa Bohol. Isha sa, sa Cebu. Uh, alam ko sa comment ko nilagay ko PMA kasi ayoko <laughs> ayoko i-disclose na kung anong school talaga. Pero, let's just say na malamilitary yung training nila sa mga full scholars sa uh, school na yun sa Cebu. Kaya, kaya that's why I just said PMA. Pero, hindi naman talaga PMA. Pero, parang, I guess, military inspired yung uh, training nila sa school at that time. Kasi full scholars siya. So, they had to follow certain rules. Then, naalala ko, um, marami silang mga physical training. Parang military talaga. Parang mag-army pang ganyan. Um, but one of the things that made the long distance relationship harder was yung rule nila na every Sunday lang sila makakagamit ng phone. So six days out of the week walang phone. Then pag isa sa team nila may ginawang um, masama or disobeyed the law or the rules sa school, I think parang isang buwan sila hindi makakagamit ng, ng phone nata. Parang kanya. Basa alam ko, we had a lot of uh, problems with communicating with each other kasi yun nga, walang access and malayo pa. It's not like I could go to visit. Hindi din. Um, so, kung sino lang yung masudyante doon, sila lang yung makakapasok sa, I guess, dormitory kasi it's inside the school. So, ito naman si Ate Totga. Tiis ganda. Tiis ganda na lang kasi <laughs> I mean, wala naman akong magagawa, di ba? Eh, noon. Wala. Wala talaga. <laughs> May sasabihin sana ako, kaya lang, nawala, nawala sa isip ko. So, yeah, yun nga. Tis, ganda na lang, and then, hintay-hintay na lang kung kailan pwede. Eh, walang magagawa eh. Mahal mo eh. Mahal ko pala. Eh, mahal dati. Mahal dati. Correction na, mahal dati. Kasi baka mag-viral na naman ito. Baka screenshot na naman ito. Pati yung sinabi ko. Kaya, sabi ko, mahal ko dati. Sige. Precise. Precise natin yan. Uh, <laughs> may trouble tayo sa girlfriend ito. Poo check. So, I, I, so I, did, I didn't see him for months. Kasi very limited lang yung time nila na makauwi. In, in, nasa, nasa Cebu siya. Ako nasa Bohol. So, I think it ran uh, maybe 8 months na hindi namin kita yung sa Then, umuwi siya ng weekend lang. 
uh, one day lang nga ata yun eh. Kasi one day lang one day lang sila pinayagan. So, umuwi siya ng one day and that was it. And then after that, balik na naman siya. Then, long distance ulit. And for a couple of months na naman. Um, so, nung ando na siya, marami ng problema na nag up. Kasi, aside from the long distance, may babae din kasi na may gusto sa kanya. Eh, yung babae yun, ewan ko kung bakit. Pero na may message siya sa akin sa Facebook. Naalala ko pa nga yun. <coughs> Ayoko i-mention yung pangalan. <laughs> teka na. Teka, nabubulunan ako. Teka, teka. <coughs> Ayoko i-mention yung pangalan. But, yun nga. Nang may message siya sa akin, sabi niya, Oh, na, huwag ka mag-alala. Ako, ako yung bahala sa kanya. Ako yung mag-aalaga mag mag sa kanya para sa'yo. Yung taga yung script niya eh. Pwis na buisit ako at that time. <laughs> Kaya lang, due to the ano nga, long distance relationship, I tried to be as calm as possible na if pwede, ayoko talaga ng arguments or ayoko talaga ng kahit anong I guess kahit anong reason na maliit na reason na pag-aawayan namin, I tried to avoid it. Kaya hindi ko na lang. Yung parang, okay, fine. Salamat. Yung parang, <laughs> ano pa yung sasabihin ko sa nga yan? Aawayin ko pa. pa. <laughs> Dabi ko na stress at that time. Sa nursing school ko yan, wala kong time sa kanya, no? Uh, well, sa babae nyo na, I mean. Um, anyways, so parang wala lang, okay. But parang napapaisip na ako na... I know itong babae ko, may gusto sa kanya kasi hindi ko siya kilala, biglaan siyang na message sa akin, like, bakit naman, di ba? Like, what's the reason for that? Hindi ko nga siya kilala, I don't even know that she existed, yung parang ganyan. <coughs> oh, nagagalit ulit ako. <laughs> eh, corona. Teka lang. <coughs> Hinga mo na ako malalim, ha? Hinga mo na ako malalim. <laughs> Teka, nawawala na ako, putik. So anyway, yung, yung, yung boyfriend ko na yun, uh, nung nasa Cebu siya, marami siyang classmate na classmate din namin sa high school. E, may nagsimbong sa akin na isang lalaki. Friend ko ah, mabait na friend to. He's not ano, hindi siya naninira or anything. Actually, he gave me a heads up. Siya sabi niya, uy, mag-ingat ka sa babae niyan kasi... Uh, gusto gusto niya, huwag <laughs> niya kumamensyo yung pangalan ni Totga. <laughs> gusto gusto niya yung, ano, yung boyfriend mo. Kahit saan daw yung boyfriend ko, yung lagi siya nag-ano nag, nag, sa kanya. Yung parang, uy, dito ka, dito ka. Or, oh, I receive a seat for you. Tabi tayo, whatever. <laughs> yun nga. So, yun nga, na, yun nga napa, napaisip na ako. Yung parang may mga suspicions na ako. At that time, not towards my boyfriend, kundi sa babae lang. Kasi, at that time, I trusted my boyfriend. Um, pero yung, yung, kahit alam mo na loyal yung, yung lalaki. Pero pag may makapain na babae, kakabwisit eh. <laughs> kakabwisit talaga. So, yun. Um, parang, okay, thank you for that. At diba, I was grateful naman kasi, I, of course, I wanted to know everything that was going on kasi, I mean, I could rarely see him. I rarely, rarely see him. And then I could, I couldn't even talk to him whenever I want. Pag, pag kailala siya pwede, then it's only gonna be a few hours, like once in one month, no, once in one week or sometimes once in one month pag, ano, pag may, may pinapanisyan sa kanila. So, um, there was, there came a time na one month na hindi kami nagkausap kasi nabisi na sila sa training, sa school, ganyan. And then, uh, of course, yung suspicions ko tumataas na, nag-iba eh, kahit ano na yung iniisip ko. I mean, sino ba namang hindi, di ba? Malayo yung boyfriend mo. Wala ako noon. Pag may problema siya, hindi ako yung andun sa kanya. Kundi ibang tao or putyang babaeng yun. <laughs> Kasi siya yung malapit eh. I mean, I can't do anything. They have the same dormitory. So, it's not like I can go in. Hindi naman. So, kaya hindi na ako pumunta ng Cebu, hindi naman ako pwedeng dumalaw. So, one day, yeah, yung parang hindi ko nata natiis yung frustrations ko, yung pagdududa ko. Then, when I finally heard from him, yung sabi niya, oh, kasi nabisi lang daw siya, which I understand, hindi ko na siya inaway. Kasi, yun nga, I could rarely talk to him, so, but aaway ko pa, di ba? So, uh, I think a week after that, 
may na, may na ano ako na report na received na chica <laughs> from one of the from one of his classmates don sa sa college na classmate ko din no high school sabi niya sa akin tumalis daw sila nang san well, I, I think it was sunday or saturday alam ko they um yung school nila they the professors nila who whoever was in charge they gave them a free time na lumabas <coughs> So, lumabas sila and then naginuman daw and parang ako like okay kasi I'm sure stress siya so you know go lang enjoy ka ganyan eh yung problema nung bumalik na sila hindi niya ako kinontak wala I like I didn't hear from him and then until next week na yun nga may nahihirapan ako mag Tagalog <laughs> parang gusto ko mag Visaya ulit um Yun nga, may na, may natanggap na ako na so sobrang, sobrang haba na text ng friend ko na babae. Sabi niya, Sam, kasi Sam yung tawag niya sa akin. Ganyan, uh, may nagsumbong sa akin. May nangyari daw, ganyan, ganyan. Yung na nalisig daw si lalaki. And then, may pumasok daw. Yung babae na gust may gusto sa kanya, pumasok daw sa, I think, room niya or dormitory niya. And then, like, she just closed the door. So, yung friend ko naman, sabi niya, narinig niya sa classmate namin, na classmate din ni Mr. Totga doon sa college. So, yung parang she wanted to wash her hands clean, which I understand, sabi niya, but ayoko na maging cause ng awan. Can you just please ask the classmate, yung classmate na lalaki na nakikita, nakakita sa kanila. So like I messaged him na tinawa, or I messaged him and tinanong ko siya and that's what he told me na yun nga nakita niya na yun nangyari but he didn't say anything kung he saw na may ginawa sila kasi he, he just saw the girl na pumasok sa kwarto but you know that's it but closed doors of course and then nalasing yung yung boyfriend ko so I didn't know what to think um I mean <laughs> Kasi naman din yung, yung boyfriend ko noon, may history din eh. <laughs> may history din yun na, na ano, ma <laughs> maano sa babae. <laughs> Pero, <coughs> may history din siya na medyo maano sa babae. Pero, nung kami na, he, he never really uh, did anything with any other girl. Yung history lang niya, like before us, kasi nga mag-best friend kami, so alam na alam ko kung anong pinaggagawa niya noon. Um, but nung kami na, he was actually good. Uh, he, he was super good to me. Yung pamilya niya, alaga ng alaga ako. Then, siya, there, yung, yung anong type ba? Na, yung type na, he's not, ano, he's not like rich, rich, pero ginagawa niya lahat to give me everything. Na, yung, yung type na, um, I guess I think he feels like I deserve a lot of things and then he tries to give me that he tries to give me everything yung ganyan na na appreciate ko talaga kasi I see the effort lahat lahat kaya lang nung nangyari yun tinanong ko siya when I finally got a hold of him tinanong ko siya hindi siya makasagot ng diretso so Yung parang I took it as maybe na guilty siya. Um, kasi sabi niya sa akin, parang nag-post lang siya na wala siya sinabi. And then after that, nung nagsalita na siya, sabi niya, I don't remember. Yung parang ganyan na, na wala akong naalala ng ganyan. Um, kasi lasing, lasing naman talaga siya. Yung talaga sabi ng, ng classmate namin noon, di ba? Nung nag-report. So, I guess... At that time, I was 17 or 18, kami dalawa. I just couldn't handle any more stress on my shoulders because it's very stressful na yung parang did something really happen or wala? Like, are you lying to me or you just don't remember? Yung parang ganyan. I just didn't want to deal with that. Aside from the long distance, aside sa yung babae at doon lagi na, na kasama nila, the yung wala kaming communication, then nasa nursing school ako, then papunta pa ako ng Amerika. Uh, ngayon kami nag-break, nag-break up the month 
after pumunta na ako na US. So parang I guess I, I just ended there. Yung I I yung kung dalhin yung stress na yon. Kasi there was so much things I was gonna be different. Then parang patong 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 yung lahat ng stress. Kaya yung para it, it was better off na nagbreak na lang kami. Kasi I mean I, I couldn't get an answer whether nayari yon or wala. Pero ayoko, ayoko na lang, ayoko na lang. Like, I, I don't want it to stay in my head. I don't want to wonder every time ko may nagawa ba talaga siya. Kasi, mag-hold lang ako ng grudge. Like, if, 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 pinagpatuloy namin yun. Um, but in the back of my mind, may maraming duda ako. I think it was just gonna make it worse, a relationship. And I don't wanna end up hating him. Kaya, I just took it as, you know what? I can't do this. Yung parang ganyan, I, 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 I just can't. Um, yung trust issues, ayoko niyan. Like, I want to be with someone where I have peace. Kung na, I have peace of mind na even though malayo, even though ibang-iba mundo namin, or wala masyadong communication, I need some sort of assurance ba na we're okay. Ayoko nang marami akong questions sa sa isip ko, like, ganyan. So, we broke up. I broke up with him. <clears throat> I felt bad kasi I don't really know kung may nangyari or wala, but I guess I, I, I chose myself. Maybe I was selfish. I admit that. But at that time, I felt like it was I don't know. It was it wasn't <laughs> it was an easier way to end it para sa akin kasi yung part of me doesn't want part of me doesn't want to believe man, na, na may nangyari talaga kasi I know I'm gonna hate him and if I start hating him not just that I lose my boyfriend but also my best friend kasi he was that important to me at that time so yung parang um, ano na lang like okay well like, dito na lang tayo. Like, let's just end it here. Na, hindi pa tayo nagkakasakitan. I mean, nasaktan. Of course, nasaktan ako. Nasaktan siya. But, ayaw kong hintayin yung time na may nangyari na makaka-cheat siya. Ayaw kong hintayin yun. Kasi, yun nga. <coughs> if mangyari yun, na totoo na mangyari yun, or, mamang, or mangyayari yun in the future, if I continue the relationship, then I'm, I'm gonna end up hating the person who was once the most important person in my life. Kaya, yun. <laughs> I don't know what else to say. Like, I don't want... I don't want to make excuses for myself. Like, I know what I did. And three years, I think two years or three years after that, Nalaman ko yung totoo na wala talaga at nalasing nalasing siya that he was so drunk that he can't even do anything even if uh, the, even if the girl would try. Mm. Parang ganyan. So, <laughs> so part of me medyo, of course, nang hinayang, diba? But at the same time, kasi three years after the breakup niyo, nakamove na ako. So I was okay with my life. But yung parang may what ifs ka lang. But that's normal. Kahit anong, anong aspect ng life. Uh, even if if you had a different, if you, if you were to go back in time, na yung, in the back of your head, may mga questions kana. What if I did this? What if I did that? Siguro iba yung life ko ngayon. Lalo na pag yung tao is not happy um, with their life ngayon. I think yun yung mga lumalabas yung mga tendency na you question yourself like what if, what if, what if. Yung parang ganyan. but. Um, actually, right now, he's happy, and I am happy. I'm happy single. Um, actually, kaka break ko lang ng boy, ng ex boyfriend ko like a year ago. Not him. Um, yung latest, yung current. I mean, sorry, not current. <laughs> yung yung latest na ano na ex. It's been a year, and I'm doing okay. Okay lang ako. I have other plans in my life. Para na iba na yung goals ko. So. I'm good, honestly. I'm I'm good where I am. Um, but travel, travel. 
yung para inaayos ko pa yung career ko. Uh, marami pa kong goals na sinet ko for myself na hindi ko pa naabot. And I want to focus on that. I don't want to focus on the past. Ayoko mag-focus na history. Kasi it, it happened for a reason. Actually, even though ano, may panghihinayan, the fact na okay ako ngayon, the fact na okay siya ngayon, that happened for a reason whether ano, uh, sinasabi nga nila, di ba? Pag walang wala talagang mistakes na nangyayari. Lesson lahat na nangyayari sa life natin. So, yeah, yun yun. <laughs> ano ko na alam mo sasabihin? Ah, uh, Oh, oh, by the way, maraming tao na nag-add sa akin sa Facebook na nagpa-personal message ng mga questions and questions about my life right now and then I guess yung yung experience ko din on with Totga. Um, pero I'll just answer those questions on the next video kasi pagkahaba-haba na talaga nito. <laughs> Baka dito tayo sang oras kasi sang gabi kayang-kaya. So I think I'll cut the video here and then aabangan niyo na lang sa next video. I'll answer everything as much as I can, as honest as I can. But I can definitely say that it was a big lesson that I had to learn the hard way. Kaya wag tularan. <laughs> Kaya bigyan niyo ng more credit yung partners niyo in regards to trusting them. Kasi minsan natatakot tayo masakta, but actually in the end yung parang because we make impulsive decisions. Tayo pa rin yung nasaktan, di ba? Tayo yung nag-cost nun, gaya ng ginawa ko. Yun nga, kasi I, I was very, ano, young pa. I was immature. I didn't know how to handle... I, don't, I didn't know how to handle uh, my emotions. And then, the fact that I was juggling career, school, love life, yung moving to the US pa. Yung para I I chose an easier way out. Honestly, if, if I think about it now, <clears throat> like I know it was my mistakes and not his and then yung nagsumbong sa akin yung nag report. He didn't do anything bad actually. He was concerned. He was my friend. He told me what he saw, but then ako lang yung parang nag-assume na something happened. So, wag tularan. Wag tularan. Hopefully, you learned something from this experience of mine. So, so, <laughs> ayan, ayan. Ta natapos din tayo. Hindi ko alam kung saan ako patutuwa mo yan. Mas circle-circle lang yung isip ko. Hindi ko alam kung how to structure the story. But, in short, kahit mahaba, in short. <laughs> yun, yun almost, almost lahat. Yun yung overview sa lahat na nangyari. Um, um, <laughs> hirap na hirap na talaga ako mag-translate eh. Sakit na yung ulo ko kaya <laughs> dito na lang tayo, okay? This is your Ate Totka and thank you so much for tuning. Thank you sa lahat ng mga nag-message. I feel the love and support and then I'm gonna give you a virtual hug for everyone that took the time to message me and to make sure that I'm okay. But I would just want to let you know that I'm completely fine and I'm happy and thank you. And then I'll see you on the next video next week for the Q&A. Bye!